from the city, a few days at a farm stay is the perfect taste of country life. Often they're hours away or hard to get to, but Mudgee's getaway cottages are right in the heart of town. So the kids can get their farm fix while the adults can still indulge in the wineries and restaurants this area is famous for. Mudgee is in the central west of New South Wales, less than four hours drive from Sydney. Just a short stroll from the main street is Mudgee's Getaway Cottages, a farm stay with six self-contained homes set on almost four hectares. So Elizabeth, who would have expected all of this in the heart of Mudgee? How would you describe what you have to offer here? I feel it's, it's so much. Well, I suppose that was my good fortune. I'm a baby boomer and I, I grew up growing outside and playing outside and nature being my teacher. And um, I wanted to recreate something similar for families because I could see that people didn't have time, they don't have the space. And what do you think guests love the most about, about this place? What do they love to get up to? Just the fact that they can walk freely throughout the gardens, they can pick their own vegetables, they can taste things fresh, um, they're teaching their children what is ripe and what's not right. We've got a camel, just by the way, um, his name's Kamal, and here you can feed him and that teaches children to um, respect something that's large and feel comfortable. And if they don't like large animals, we go right down to baby mice. I've got um, a padding shed down there where they can pick up a little guinea pig. Come on in. Yeah, that's good. Just need to wash. Who wants to feed the chooks? Yeah, grab a handful and just throw it like that. Hello, good boy. Hey, that's not your food. No, it's not your food. <laughs> the chook food. Don't forget these guys over here. <laughs> good boy. <laughs> he wants the whole thing. He's like, none of this one leaf at a time. It's easy to see why the cottages are so popular with return guests. <laughs> the experience designed to give families the best of both worlds. Ooh, he's a bit hard to hold. Oh, OK. Do you want to pat him like this? Oh, look at that. There's too many to choose from to have a hole. Look at this bunny. It's so cute. Look at, look at his little feet. So oh, look fluffy. at this one. <laughs> now, there's so much to do outside, but then the manor is a bit of an experience in itself, right? The manor is a building that was built in the 1900s. And again, like Mudgee, it's a very historic town and this is a beautiful building to show people all about the history of yesterday. I've been a bit of a hoarder all my life, so all the old box brownies and everything has it's been rebirthed off. in here. With six ensuite bedrooms, this early 1900s Federation home was painstakingly renovated to retain its heritage and now proudly houses a wealth of local history and artefacts. <laughs>